In Vault to Create, there are four main processes within world building and performing, which once understood will enable you to use the app more comfortably. When you open Vault for the first time, you'll be presented with a quick onboarding tutorial. I highly recommend doing this as it only takes a couple of minutes to help you understand how Vault to Create is laid out, how its controls work, depending on if you're using a Mac or a Windows device, and will guide you in configuring your audio settings for the best experience. You can either choose from one of our base worlds, or, alternatively, you can start a new world from blank. First, add an element to your world by clicking on the plus icon next to the elements header in the sidebar. Elements are what we call 3D assets within Volta Create. When clicking on an element, you'll be given the option to attach a visual source. These are 2D elements, such as videos, photos, or even a webcam feed. You can then wrap this around the element. We support Siphon, Spout, as well as MDI, so you can use programs like Touch Designer and Resolume as a source if that's your preference. Once you have an element with an attached visual source, we can move on to making these elements audio reactive. To choose the behaviour that you want to react to your audio input, click on the link icon to the right of it. You'll be presented with a list of available inputs. By default, your microphone is selected as your audio input, but you can change this to a direct line feed for a clearer signal. Now, you can select which frequency range you would like to make audio reactive, low, medium or high, or sync it to a set beat. Now that you have a world with your own elements, it's time to either stream or record a video using Volta. We recommend first entering the performance tab and enabling cameras. This will give you the option of switching between six different camera angles which you can pre-configure to your liking. When ready to record, double check your input settings to make sure you're recording at your desired quality and resolution. To stream, there are a few different options. Either input the stream key for the platform of your choice or authorize your account through Vault to Create directly. Then all you need to do is click start streaming and you'll be streaming directly from Volta to the platform of your choice. If you'd rather use hardware to control Volta Create, this is also possible using a MIDI connection. Plug your MIDI controller into your computer and shift click on the slider that you wish to map to your controller. Then move the slider knob or button on your MIDI device to map it to this parameter. 